little bit with aloe because sometimes people can have reactions to aloe. So you want to be careful oh, there. I have a question. Sure. Is it better to is it better to keep it moist or to dry it out? Dry, 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 dry. Definitely don't want to moist. Okay. Don't keep moist. But if you're gonna if you're gonna if it's uh, use the uh, omega six healing cream, that will keep it just moist enough, and you'll get all the vitamin C and the um, the other healing ingredients that I put in there in addition to the omega six fats. And that's probably your best bet. And I'll try to get that out to you sooner rather than later. And I'm sorry I didn't get back to you via email also, Crystal. Does that help you? Are you good? Uh, I hope it works. <laughs> okay, good. Stay in touch, man. And uh, don't forget to send me an email with your address so I can send out this cream to you, okay? Okay, and can I send the image with it as yeah, well? Yeah, that would be maybe? great. Yeah, why don't you put your phone number in there and I'll call you and we can, we can chat on the phone. Uh, uh, Thanks, Ben. I love your voice. It's so happy and everything. Oh, I appreciate <laughs> that. Thank you. Have a great day. We'll talk to you soon. Okay, bye, Crystal. Oh, that was sweet. All right, if you uh, sent me a note and requesting some omega-6 healing cream, I didn't get it out to you. My apologies. I'm putting out a whole bunch of stuff. Uh, I'm a one-man band here, you guys. I'm trying to, I'm juggling as fast as I can. So if I haven't sent it out to you yet, hang tight. I'll get it out to you hopefully sometime this week. And uh, if you have not sent me a letter and you want to get a sample of the cream, send a note to Ben at ksco.com. Tell me you want a sample of the Omega-6 Healing Cream. And don't forget your address. Some of you guys are sending me requests with no address. So don't forget your address. And hopefully uh, it's much easier for me if you can put it in a way that I can cut and paste it right to my uh, address label software. Let's see. And then if you've gotten the product, and uh, I would love to hear how, you, how it's working for you. If it's working really well for you, I'd love to get a testimonial from you. I'm collecting testimonials in a file, so when my website goes up here in a couple of weeks, we'll have a bunch of testimonials and pictures, and you'll be able to see how the stuff really works. Okay, Truth Raider, Carl, what is up? Welcome to the Bright Side, my friend. How you doing, buddy? Good morning. Top of the week to you there, Pharmacist Ben, or just Ben. Yeah, I guess I only like to be called you Ben. That's just call me Ben. That's right. <laughs> okay, this is on? a segment I like to call Truth Raider Tips. Okay. Really quick. But okay. first, let me, let, me, let me thank you for mentioning me to a couple, I guess, you saw at the uh, Las Vegas convention, I guess. They, they live here locally in Portland, Oregon. Yes. Did they hook up with you? Line. Yeah, they, they called me last night and wanted to invite me to their twice-a-week get-together on longevity products. Oh, that's awesome. So they're already doing it in Portland. Yes, yes, there's a couple give, that, that... Give them a plug. What, I don't remember I, their name. Do you remember their I names? I forgot their... You know, I'm sorry, I forgot their names, but I'll oh. do that in the future. Okay, cool. I forgot what their couple's names were, but I know exactly where they live, and I'm, they're very nice, so I'm going to meet with them tonight. They anyway, two for your tips for the week. Yes. Hey, hey, Ben, do you realize that you're only on maybe about 34 minutes out of the whole hour? You mean with the commercials and everything? Yes, you're on 34 minutes. So, I'm, you know, just a suggestion, uh, budgeting a, a little bit of your time. Okay. When you get to the callers, give them about 30 seconds to a minute because you 30 want to seconds. To yeah. <laughs> That's not even enough time to tell them. Tell me their name. Barely. <laughs> well, you, you you can figure out. Okay. How, how, I'll get how to more do calls. It. You mean I could take more calls that way? That's, that's right. It's that way that you can get to everybody because I know you want to talk to everybody. You don't want to leave do. anybody hanging. I hate leaving people on hold, and I always end up doing that. So no, I apologize. So you think I should spend less time with individual callers? Is that what you're saying? Well, just give them a chance to, to, to just explain something really brief. That way you can get to them and give them the most information on how to take care of their conditions as, as, as uh, quickly as possible and as complete as possible. Okay. So you're saying just have them bullet do, I always say bullet points when I'm doing phone calls. I always ask for bullet points. So, yeah, I think that's a good idea. Uh, you know, I, I always hate cutting people. As much as I hate leaving people on hold, I also hate people cutting them. I hate cutting people off when they're telling me something, even though I end up doing that all the time. I don't like doing it. So I haven't figured out a way to do it. You know, I've, I've had opportunities. Ted Anderson's asked me if I want to do a two-hour show, a two-hour program, uh, and so I'm contemplating that. I may end up doing a two-hour show where we just talk about skin care because I've been really antsy about about talking about skin care. I try to squeeze it in wherever possible, but now I have these new products coming out. So maybe I'll have a, a longer show and we can expand how much time we spend with people. But your point is well taken, Carl, the truth raider. I appreciate it. So you're thinking just have people talk for 30 seconds or a minute, tell me their issues, and then we just go right into solving the problem. Is that what you're saying? Right. I think you, I, But I think it needs to go the direction of two-hour show. I think everyone out there would, would like to, to have two hours of the bright side every morning. You think? I don't know. I don't know if that's the case. They may get sick of me. Two hours. <laughs> <laughs> two, hours uh, no. two hours a day of Ben, a pharmacist Ben. Okay, well, I appreciate the point, though. That, thank, you, thank you for bringing that up. Is there anything else? Do you have any questions or anything today? No, that's, that's it for today. Get to the callers out there. God bless, and we'll I, talk to you again later. 
I appreciate that, Carl, the truth raider. You know, that is a, that isn't a bad idea. I just don't feel comfortable when, you know, it's, it's bad bedside manner to, to cut folks off uh, when you're telling me a story or you're telling me about what's going on with your health. So I always feel uncomfortable about cutting people off. But at the same time, I always feel uncomfortable about, uh, about, uh, about leaving people on hold. And I know you guys are frustrated when I leave you on hold. I've gotten, I've gotten some letters. People actually complain about leave, being left on hold. So I'm not sure what the alternative to that is. If you think it's a good idea to do uh, an extra hour, why don't you send me an email and just tell me what your thoughts are about doing another hour or if you think it's a good idea to do uh, maybe an hour on nutrition, general nutrition, bodily nutrition, and then perhaps uh, perhaps do an hour on skincare, skincare subjects alone. I've been doing talking about skincare for many years. I was alluding to this before uh, earlier in the program. It really, as a guy who's been doing skincare for many years and really conscientiously trying to help people change their skin, change their lives via changing their skin, because as superficial as and cosmetic as it may seem when you have a skincare problem, it could be debilitating, emotionally debilitating, especially for kids who have acne. And, and the thing about skin issues, eczema, acne, rosacea, none of them, none of them are, 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 are things that you need to be dealing with if you know what's going on. The skin is super responsive to nutrition, super responsive to supplementation, super responsive to lifestyle changes, and the skin uh, skin cells grow, turn over every four to eight weeks. That basically means that for many, if not most, skin care health issues, certainly for eczema and psoriasis, if you have it today, you don't have to have it four to eight weeks from now. Certainly this is true about all health issues, but specifically about the skin because of the rapidity, the speed at which skin cells grow and skin cells divide. Nobody has to be condemned to a skin care, skin health issue. And despite what you're hearing from people selling you products, they're not topical issues for the most part. And for the most part, there's not a lot you can do topically to take care of a skin care problem with the exception of certain key nutrients, vitamin C and vitamin A especially. And uh, as far as healing goes, certain anti-inflammatory perhaps or, or calming kinds of substances. I use some of those in my truth products. Um, but mostly it's vitamin A and vitamin C that you're going to need to be using if you want to have healthy, beautiful skin. And if you want to have anti-age skin, of course, you need to throw in something acidic like apple cider vinegar or perhaps aloe or glycolic acid or lactic acid. We'll be, uh, we'll be talking lots more about skin in the coming days. Anyway, tomorrow we'll uh, continue talking about prostaglandins and we'll talk about zinc. I want to cover a little bit about this whole Ebola stuff. You know, much ado about nothing in my humble opinion. Not that Ebola is nothing, but... Uh, the, the freak out about Ebola. That's much ado about nothing. Okay, let's see. That's all the time we have for today. Send me an email, ben at ksco.com if you want to be put on our email list for uh, not being notified about videos that we do. Myself and health coach Amanda Rideout or call the Brightside Ben phone team at 866-735-2470 if you want to join the Brightside Ben team. Thanks for listening, folks. Have a wonderful, awesome, spectacular day. I'm Pharmacist Ben. We'll talk to you all later. Bye for now.